ladies and gentlemen, how are you? Welcome to Atta Education Ingredients. My name is Rosalia Wong. Guess what I'm going to bring you today? Today, the topic is called An Educator's Social Consciousness. <music> So in the article Negotiating the Democratic Classroom by Colin and Heaney in 2001, I noticed a few statements which might be useful for changing some of our views as adult educators. So the question is how to learn to be um, free democratically. The quote by um, Manning in 1992 cited by Colin Heaney 2001 say that a political vision of emancipation is more than a set of ambitious goals. It's the courage to uh, state what's wrong with our society. The real problem isn't with the politicians but lie within ourselves. This is the thing about the quote. So Colin and Heaney actually continue to discuss the uh, how do we cope with the anti-democratic practices within the adult education program sectors. For example, they put forward number one, we must practice what we teach, they say. It means that we should have an articulated, uh, articulated plan to transform ourselves in this ongoing learning, with the ongoing learning. And you begin with the acknowledgement that what we may know about something, but not all this, there is to be known. So we must relentlessly search out the other intellectual paradigm and make space for competing ideas, concepts, and philosophies. Number two, they put forward is what must be willing. Uh, we must be willing to consider alternative uh, models of graduate adult education. So the most important focus is on creating trust, respect, and academic democratic uh, practice, and that takes time. Of course, it is all what they suggest is about adult education. It, it also requires other, other, other profession as well. So this is just an example that I'm, I'm putting forward to let you know. And number three, uh, Colin and Hini also put forward say we must not be afraid to critique the assumption that influences our social and political worldviews. For example, that is um, we need to hide uh, this is to heighten the le our level of social consciousness which will alter our view regarding the social political implication of our practice in any profession of course so the practice of democracy can encounter obstacles the same as all other group all other uh, profession not only just education so the practice of democracy in the higher education sector circumstance within the regime which require vigilance. Hence the challenge to create a participatory practice within the higher education or other profession class in the classroom or in the workplace in, the, in inevitably uh, pushing the borders, anticipating and countering resistance. That's all for my topic today and um, welcome to subscribe to my channel if you think you uh, like the contents also share with your friends so you will not miss anything when I uh, upload the uh, videos and putting forward the new ingredients and new insights and new topics whenever it is. So I will go away for a holiday for a few weeks and then I will get back to you and bring you more information on adult education ingredients for your profession and your organization. Thank you very much for tuning in today. Until next time, stay safe and goodbye.